Hello everyone, thank you for checking out this video. You are with Coach Joel from Terry Chill Academy. Right now, we are going to solve this question together. For this lesson, we will be using tricks in addition as well to solve this question. Okay, so the question is asking you for the last four digits of this long looking equation 1 plus 11 plus 111 and so on until you have 10 ones okay so the main thing you need to find is actually just the last four digit okay so let's look at the last digit first okay how many of one do you have okay so if you look at the last digit of each and every number okay you realize that because you have all the way up to 10 ones, okay, therefore, okay, let's just call it the ones digit, okay? So your ones digit, you will actually have 10 times of 1, and this will actually give you 10, okay? Which means to say that, therefore, your ones digit is equals to 0, Okay, and as well as you will carry forward 1. Okay, this is very important because this will actually affect your tens digit. Okay, so once again, let's look at the tens digit now. Now, instead of having 10 ones, you only have 9 ones. Why? It's because the first number does not have any tens place at all. Okay, so if you were to look at the tens digit, okay, we only have nine ones. However, you must remember to add your carry forward of one from your ones digit. Okay, so technically you have nine times one, but you plus one, which is your carry forward. Okay, and this is nine plus one, which is equals to ten. Okay, and this also means that your tens digit must be equals to zero as well. And because the tens place, there is another one over there. It means that you actually also carry forward another one. Okay, but this one now will go into your hundreds digit. Okay, so let's look at the hundreds digit now. Okay, so if we look at the hundreds digit, the same concept, okay, now you'll notice that 11 also does not have any hundred at all. So instead of having 10 of it or 9 of it, you only have 8 of it. Okay, so we have 8 times 1. But once again, we need to add our carry forward of 1. Okay, and we will get 8 plus 1, which is equals to 9. Okay, so we can see that therefore your hundreds digit is equals to 9. Okay, and you realize that in this particular scenario, there is no carry forward at all. So we, have, we don't have to add 1 the next time we go on to the thousands. Okay, now we can solve for thousands as well. So the thousands digit, okay, which is the fourth last digit, now, instead of 10, 9, or 8, it will only have 7 times 1, okay? Based on the same concept that your 111 does not even have a 1,000 as well, okay? So, 7 times 1 will give you 7, okay? Which means to say that your 1,000 digit is equals to 7, Okay? And from here, you will be able to find the answer, okay? The question is asking you for the last four digits, okay? Therefore, the last four digits, okay, is equals to... So, you have to start from your thousands place first, then you move up to your hundreds, your tens, and finally your ones, okay? So, which are the circled ones that I've circled for you. So, your last four digits is actually equals to 7 
And that is your answer. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you have enjoyed today's lesson. Goodbye and see you again in another lesson. If you would like to learn more from these tutorials, please smash that like and subscribe button.